Hi, welcome to my guitar tutorial on uh, improvisation uh, using F sharp 5, G5, and A5. So look for the uh, PDF in, in the description below the video. That'll just have all the notes from the key of D. So F sharp 5, G5, and A5 are all part of um, the, the key of, of, of uh, D. So that's going to be the three chord, the four chord, and the five chord. I'll just go uh, briefly through uh, the notes in the open position. So what I'm doing is I'm doing four notes for every string potentially. So E, F sharp, G, A, A, B, C sharp, D, D, E, F sharp, G, G, A, B, C sharp. I probably won't use that note very much. And then B, C sharp, D, E, and then E, F sharp, G, A. All right, so this was an idea I, I came up with uh, last night after, after dinner. I was just practicing and just trying out some different things, and I thought, well, this is kind of a nice little riff here. So this is the G, F sharp. G, A. And then as I started thinking about that, I thought, well, rather than playing the G like this, I thought, well, I'll just play an open G chord. And then rather than playing the A here, I would just play an open A chord. So so the idea with this video is you can, uh, I'll, I'll play some chords for you, and then I'll improvise and we'll kind of go back and forth, kind of like what I was just doing there. So I was playing the chords and I was improvising without any, without any backing track. So um, how about I'll do that next? So I'll play, um, I'll play four, you know, you know, four times through the progression, and you know, and then I'll and then I'll improvise for for four times with, without any chords, and we'll see how that goes. Uh, just to to start off with. Okay, you play two, three, four. Then as I was playing through this progression, I, I started kind of messing around with the rhythm a little bit. So I thought, well, it kind of sounds interesting to play three note power chord and then add those notes on top. Right, and then for the G chord, that works pretty well. It just makes like a G6 chord. And then for the A chord, I just play like an A, just those two notes there and then add in the B and E on top. So I'll, so I'll play that a, a couple of times. That's, that's kind of an interest, interesting sound. So how about this time, just to change it up, I'll play two times through the progression for you to, to, to improvise, and then I'll play two times through. We'll go back and forth a couple of times. 
Can you play one, two, three, four? Okay, I'll do one more thing in this video. So, so the other, the other thing I thought sounded kind of interesting was to do a full bar chord, just an F sharp minor bar chord. That's kind of interesting. Okay, and then what was I doing here? I'll then call the G chord. That's what I did. So I do here. So bar chord. Okay, then f like a G, like a G five, and then just move that up to here, E A. Kind of gives it a little bit more open sound. So. I'll play that for you like eight eight times, so you can kind of just uh, improvise o over this over this um, kind of more open sounding progression. One, two, three, four. Okay, so that's all I have for you today. I uh, just thought you would find that uh, interesting. Uh, you know, just some, some of the chords I came up with. Very, very sort of simple progression, but I can try to give it a little different spin. And then I provided you uh, uh, a scale chart that you can just kind of just make up your own uh, own uh, phrases or anything uh, just to, to, to do your own thing. So I'll, I'll end the video with just a little improvisation, um, kind of how I start the video. I'll play. Um, how about play one time, one time, just go back and forth. Um, okay, so thanks for listening and watching.